A new motorsports park is on its way to Cumberland County, originally set for Oak Ridge. Developers now plan to put it on almost 800 acres off Interstate 40 at the West L exit. 10 News reporter Marissa Rios looks at the plans and talks to fans of that sport about the new location. The motorsports complex had initial plans to be in Oak Ridge, but the location turned into a no-go. When uh, the project died in Oak Ridge, uh, the next morning I called Rusty Biddle. Ray Evans is the economic development director for the Plateau Park Partnership. He says he knew this would be the best location for Biddle's motorsports complex. Twice the acreage, uh, great rolling terrains, which for a, a, a motorsports park road course is, is ideal. Additional amenities will showcase the Cumberland Plateau, including an amphitheater, winery, hotel, brewery, and the list goes on. The Crossville Chamber of Commerce says the development will bring an influx of people to East Tennessee. Having a motorsports park destination with all the other amenities and activities that Flat Rock USA has planned is really just going to take us to a higher level. Motorsports fanatics just like Knoxville native Stephen Smith say they're ecstatic. We're over the moon. We really are. We're over the moon about the news. Smith says he's always had to take his own motorcycling adventures further away. They're all quite a haul compared to just right down the road here. For him and his buddies, this is a game changer. I think in our riding community, every single person I know was talking about which track bike they were going to buy in the next year or so once the, once the track is ready. It's just been a phenomenal uh, response. Flat Rock will break ground this year with the Motorsports Park projected to be completed in phases, the first as early as next summer. Again, that was Marissa Rios reporting. The property for that site is through a group called the Plateau Park Partnership. That's a joint effort among the counties of Roan, Morgan, and Cumberland. The partnership says all three county mayors do support that complex.